folks, Brody Dorland here with a quick walkthrough of our DiviHQ 3.0 dashboard interface. The new dashboard brings a fresh look to a familiar layout, but I wanted to point out several improvements that you're going to love. For starters, you'll notice we've adjusted the column layout to make room for everything, so you can now see recent activity, upcoming content deadlines, published content, and your task list all in one screen. Next, you now have the ability to easily filter each of these dashboard widgets. For example, let's say that I'm a copywriter for our blog and I really don't need to see all of the other content deadlines from across my organization. By clicking the little gear icon in the Content Items Due widget, I have the option to filter by date range, calendar, or team members. In this case, I'm just going to select the Acme blog calendar since that's what I primarily work on each day. Then clicking the Update Feed button, I'll narrow my list of upcoming deadlines down to just upcoming blog post deadlines. From now on, every time I come back to my dashboard, Divi will remember those filter settings and only display blog deadlines. If I ever want to remove that filter, simply open the widget settings, click Clear Filters in the lower left, and click Update Feed. Your preferences will be saved each time you update your filters. The last new addition is the completely redesigned preview function for content items and tasks. Single clicking any content item or task will trigger a panel to slide in from the right. From this panel you can easily adjust most of the item's details, add comments, view attachments, and manage tasks. To open a content item in the Divi HQ sandbox, you can click the link at the top or double click on a content item title throughout the dashboard. We hope you like the improvements we've made to help simplify your content marketing efforts, and a big thank you to those who provided feedback. The 3.0 dashboard is a direct result of your ideas and feature requests. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you didn't. For more videos, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching and happy divvying!